Absolutely, down for the seventh day in a row. And look at that intraday chart, right? The moves are head spinning in either direction. Yeah. First, they fall to 17,300 when we have breached all our lows. The 200 day moving average breached the budget day low, as Sonal pointed out. But then there was a recovery. Mm. The recovery started at 11 a.m., it went on to about 12 p.m. We went to levels of almost 17,400. But that rally got fade, you know, uh, faded, you know, faded, and the Nifty once again tried to get back to that 17,300 mark. Uh, so it's still in a very difficult uh, place for our market. Shrikant Chauhan of Kotak Securities is now with us uh, on the show now. Uh, Shrikant, uh, afternoon, and thanks so much for joining in. What have you made of the day's action, the decline over the last seven days? Yeah, uh, good afternoon, Riba. I think see the markets are uh, very clearly. Uh, approaching to the very crucial levels uh, in terms of technicals because after almost six months, the market is uh, approaching to the uh, level of 200 days simple moving average. And whenever we uh, see the market is falling to the uh, same, uh, we see some consolidation uh, before falling further or before rebounding from these levels. Uh, if we compare the market of last 10, 15 days or seven days, then it is completely oversold market and we can expect one rebound in the near term. Also, in terms of retracements, extensions, the market is having support between 17,300 to 200. So I think it's a time uh, we should look for adding some good companies uh, to the short-term portfolio. We can again expect rebound in the near term. Again, we can expect 17,600 or 650 on the higher side. That is on the maximum side. We are not expecting market to cross 17,700 so easily. But yes, we can see the rebound to the levels of 17,000. Uh, 600 levels. Okay, that is the levels on the Nifty. What are the individual stocks uh, or trading bets for you, Shrikant? Yeah, I think, see, all these uh, mid-cap stocks are, uh, again, uh, falling to their important support levels and those which are relatively doing well, uh, we should track uh, or we should look for adding them to the portfolio. We like uh, Mahindra Life, which is currently trading around some 370, 75. Uh, in the past, uh, when, uh, when the stock was recovering from the lower levels, we saw a huge amount of volumes. So certainly it's a buy at current levels uh, with a target of 420 on the high side. We can keep stop loss somewhere close to 355. And the other stock which we like is from the PSU basket that is Bank of Baroda because today we are seeing some relief for all these PSU banks. In that Bank of Baroda looks good which is currently trading around some 156, 158. Uh, there we are expecting stock to move towards 170 and we can keep stop loss somewhere close to 152. Thank you very much for that. Let's get to our segment, Mid-Cap Movers. Vivek is here. He's on the big ball and he's going to take us through the mid-caps that are moving around in trade. Vivek. Well, thank you so much for that. You know, it's another session where you're actually seeing the decline.